we want to start using Lumion's built-in layer system and this will help us toggle things on and off that way we don't have to render the trees all the time so let's hit the select button here and let's click any tree or any rock left click and now we're going to get this dialog window over here let's click this arrow right here show advanced options and we want to click what's called select all objects in category what this will do is select all the objects in the nature category so we can place them on a different layer on the top left corner we see this little eyeball with a number this is the layer by default everything's on layer one let's click layer two and then let's click move selection to layer this will bring everything that's on or uh, this will take everything that's selected and put it on this layer let's left click there and let's just rename this to trees okay so we have that and now let's do the same thing for the rocks so i'm going to left click the rocks and now i'm going to show advanced options again and select all objects in category perfect and I'm going to hit move selection to layer So now all my rocks and all my trees should be on this layer and to confirm that I can left click the eyeball icon and there we go so we'll notice that it's going to run much better the, the program will because it's not rendering all those additional polygons and if we ever need to see what it would look like with those assets we can just left click it and see it in real time so let's continue and start adding even more stuff along the perimeter of the site so the backyard is fairly empty so let's use the cluster tool for now for a couple objects and let's make sure leafless is selected like this i'm just going to add a couple clusters so we can get some practice in with this tool i'll do the same thing with the front yard too and what's great about mass placement and clusters is we can always go back and edit the placement of these objects it's not like we're locked into using this forever or leaving that location forever so now with mass placement selected let's left click here and drag out and let's left click i'm not too happy about this angle so what i'm going to do is hover over here and just drag that over a bit i'm just holding down my left mouse button and moving that over so it's better aligned and i'm noticing there's a little too many rocks so what i'm going to do is just remove that from this section hit remove and now it'll just array whatever is in this container and i'm okay with that let's hit check mark and i'm going to add a couple more trees on the sides of the buildings i'm going to click right over here okay click right there and then drag out I'm going to lower the amount of items because it's just too dense for that area okay that looks great and whoops I'm going to do the same thing right over here okay lower the amount of items okay perfect and since I'm still on layer two and I'm adding things while I'm on layer two. Anything new will automatically go there. So if I toggle this, that will turn off 